Right, so because of the timing of when I've released the ramp test video, uh, I'm actually going to do week one and week two recap in the uh, same video. Right, just done my uh, first uh, real session for the week. Yeah, no, feels really good. Kept my FTP at 290, despite the test saying I should change it to 277. Yeah, felt good. Watch an episode of uh, Star Trek Discovery at the same time. Um, yeah, also good. So it's uh, Saturday. <laughs> ah. I am ready for my next session, which is Baxter, one and a half hours, endurance, uh, I'm just supposed to focus on cadence training. Following the plan has a purpose. We'll stick to that, see how it goes. I'm just gonna put my headphones on and uh, enjoy, hopefully. Catch you later. Put the uh, fan on full blast. Oh, can't get my hat back up. Ah, moral of the story. Probably uh, need to cut my hair. That's the main reason I'm wearing the cap while working out. Right, just finished Baxter. Um, felt good, got tougher near the end. A bit tired, I pushed a massive snowball uh, yesterday. It was huge. Um, so it's sort of like big all body workout that was. <laughs> so yeah, the um, first week went quite well, as you can see. Um, we did go out on Sunday on our bikes. Uh, it was not successful. That's just pure ice. We've had a little, a little off going down the hill. In case you're wondering, Sophie uh, was fine. Don't really need to go into why she crashed, but you saw in the video, it's just pure ice on the whole thing. We walked back up the hill and then she cycled and I cycled uh, the rest of the way home from there. It's just a little bit sore and, you know, not too keen to cycle outside for a while afterwards. But uh, yeah, that's what happens when you crash. Right, it's Thursday morning and um, although I'm not going to work, I'm doing a sort of commute, uh, or a fake commute. Just doing a little ride and uh, this evening, I have uh, another one hour sweet spot session. And my little faux mute has also uh, taken me around, or trying to go around a little lake near where we live. It's usually gravel paths, but as you can see behind me, uh, it's action. Right, the uh, camera died, it's too cold. It's all just ice. I can imagine a lot of people are wondering, would studded tyres help? No. Woo! Enjoying the Arctic breeze. <sighs> right, literally just finished my uh, Thursday night session. One hour with 36 minutes of sweet spot. And uh, oh, it feels really good to be back training, feeling positive about training and uh, yeah, sharing this positivity with you lot, if anyone's watching. Hopefully uh, I can keep it going for a long time. Yeah, Friday evening uh, was quite nice, so we uh, thought we'd treat ourselves and uh, cycle down, collect some Domino's pizza and enjoy a nice sunset on our ride as well. So yeah, the plans to do Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. Uh, keep it structured, keep it the same for all the indoor rides um, as much as possible. But we haven't seen much sun this winter in Gothenburg. That thing behind me 
haven't seen it for a while so I thought I'd uh, go outside despite it being minus 12 and uh, get a little outdoor ride in and try and enjoy the sunshine while I can. It's uh, cold but bearable. Yeah, Sunday's ride, really good. Um, five times 10 minutes at sweet spot. Haven't done that much sweet spot for a long time. Definitely okay at 290 watts FTP. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to say. Uh, surprised how good it feels. Uh, really happy to be back training and uh, yeah, really happy to be spending some time doing this as well. Right, if you want to see the specifics of my training, um, Follow some links below, Strava, Trainer Road. Uh, I'll put up a lot of Insta stories when I am training. Uh, I don't want to talk too much about it in the vlog because uh, it might be boring. I don't know. Yeah, catch you in the next one. Bye.